Luke, obviously three games into pre-season now for Dagenham and Redbridge. Obviously, it kind of takes a bit of time to get going at first, but how are you feeling? Yeah, I feel good. I feel like we've got a good bunch of players in. I feel, think we're starting to bond together. Obviously, playing with a few different players is a bit difficult, like getting to know each other, how each other's plays. But starting to create some good partnerships between the group now with the new lads that have come in. And to be fair, I've been quite surprised with the players that we have brought in due to the circumstances and that, so it's been good. So there are obviously a lot of new players, but you're one of the kind of few players from last year that are still around. Just in terms yeah. of obviously what's that been for yourself in terms of mindset, uh, and obviously the other players as well, Matt Robinson and Elliot as well, still sticking here. What's it? What's yeah, that been obviously like? we didn't really know too much what was going on like behind the scenes and that. So we we were literally just we prepared ourselves, just ready to come back in. So we knew in ourselves what we had to do to come back into the team and. As we come in, obviously it was a bit difficult because we were trying to juggle, we ain't got enough players, we didn't really know what was going on, but when we come in, everything was set up properly, we had enough players, we had the play new players coming in, and obviously we started signing players, so it was just as normal, really. And in terms of obviously the new management setup as well, you've had some time to work with Peter, and obviously Terry, who's come back to the club yeah. too. Um, just kind of give us a flavour of what it's been like training with them. Uh, good, it's different, I feel like it's a different gaffer compared to that, still, but I'm enjoying working with them so far, they've been good. Obviously Terry was here before so we know what he's about. Um, it's just been good to get back with him. And uh, obviously tonight against Colchester you had the armband on. Uh, has Peter spoken to you perhaps about taking on the, perhaps maybe being one of the players that does take on the captaincy this year? No, I think he's just having a look at a few players. Obviously we're trying to be very vocal out there because it's a very young team at the end of the day. I'm still 22 but like, there's a lot of players around my age where everyone's kind of new and young so we're just trying to help each other through and just be allowed and everyone's trying to be a leader at the end of the day so in terms of what you said there about being kind of quite young and, and almost having to be an experienced head I mean is it a strange circumstance for yourself to kind of find yourself in at your age yeah definitely because obviously I I played a few games in this league like now so I'm one of the more experienced players which I'm still only 22 like I said so it's difficult for me I'm taking it on and enjoying it We've seen plenty of youngsters already this season. Obviously, um, yeah, Liam Gordon playing out there at left-back. Started both of the two home friendly so far. Obviously, today had Elliot Bond's midfield, Tyreek Hyde. Plenty of the academy youngsters came on as well. Um, I'm sure they've been involved in training with you guys at the minute. So, in terms of kind of what you've seen from them, is there promising signs? Yeah, definitely promising signs. Obviously, we, they trained with us a bit at the end of last year. So, we knew what they had a bit. And they've come in, they've done well, and they've earned their rights to play. And they're playing at the moment. So, obviously, it's going to take a bit of... A bit, bit of getting used to for them, getting used to the, the physical side. That's why playing teams like this are good against men and that. So, but now they've settled in, settled in well. And obviously, just a few games left now before the that season does kick off good and proper. So, is it just a case of obviously, as you said earlier on, about trying to build up those partnerships with the new players, but also equally getting the fitness in your legs? Yeah, exactly. It's first 90 minutes for me, so last 20 minutes are a bit of start cramping up a bit, but. Like I say, that'll come with more pre-season. Like, pre-season isn't for the first game of the season, it's for towards the end. So as long as we're ready and sharp for the first game of the season, that's all that matters.